Assalamu alaikum, my brothers and sisters. Peace be upon you. Welcome to Minutes to Paradise. Jihad doesn't mean holy war. Instead, it means the inner struggle that one endures in trying to submit their will to the will of Allah. Jihad is an Arabic term that translates to struggle or striving in English. Islamic teachings understand jihad in two main forms, the greater jihad and the lesser jihad. Greater jihad. This refers to the personal struggle of an individual to maintain righteousness, improve oneself and resist temptation. It involves self-reflection, self-discipline and adherence to Islam's principles and teachings. The greater jihad is considered more significant and challenging. Lesser jihad. This refers to external actions taken to defend or promote Islam. It encompasses physical and defensive warfare against oppression or aggression when a Muslim community is under threat. The emphasis here is on self-defense and the protection of rights for oppressed individuals and communities. Interpretations of the concept of lesser jihad have varied throughout history. Some view it strictly as defensive warfare, while others have taken a broader perspective. Islamic scholars widely agree that military actions should be conducted with adherence to Islamic principles, such as the protection of non-combatants, proportionality, and adherence to just war principles. It is crucial to understand that the term jihad has been misused by certain individuals or groups to justify acts of violence. Such actions contradict Islam's true teachings of peace, justice and compassion. Muslims reject and condemn violence that harms innocent people. Jihad, far from being synonymous with holy war, encompasses both the inner struggle for righteousness and the external defense of Islam. By exploring the true teachings and understanding the diverse interpretations, we gain a deeper appreciation of this essential concept in Islam.